How's everyone doing? This is Jason Fulton of Craftsman Remodeling and Carpentry LLC out of Guilford, Connecticut. Giving a brief, well, hopefully it's brief, testimonial and a demonstration of some of the Festool tools that I own. Um, you know, I can't just pick out one. You know, they all work great. It's all full system. And you'll see what I'm talking about. They're just incredible. I've been asked why I love Festool so much, and honestly, I can't really answer. I don't know if it's the cool green color, um, you know, the fact that they remind me of tools that my grandfather used, the old craftsman tools that worked forever and never died, or if it's just the whole system. And, you know, I'll show you some of the tools that I own, and maybe you can decide for yourself. And if you're wondering why my hat got so dirty, it wasn't from the Festool tools with the vacuum hooked up. It's from some other jobs, all right? Well, stay tuned, and I'll show you the track saw and the, one of the drills, and we'll go through that, all right? Thanks. Okay, please mind the mess. Um, I'm redoing my workshop, my little workshop here. And... Of course, I'm using the Festool to help me out. First off, this is the CT22. It's a little older vacuum unit. You know, the new ones have the HEPA filter all set up inside, but this one's a good one. And, you know, what's great about this is that you can use it so that you can just vacuum it. Or you can leave it on auto. And that way you can set it up so that you can just, you know, if you're using the track saw, this is TS-75, and this was my first purchase. You know, most people purchase the um, track saw first, the TS-55 or the 75. This was my first purchase. I got with the, I like to go by inches, the 55 inch, I mean, uh, 75 inch guardrail, I mean, uh, track came with it and I also have a 55 and a 32 and what's great about this is that you can tie them together or you can buy a large one I apologize I'm doing this all one handed this right here you can join multiple units together by sliding this right inside there, clamping it down. You can put another one in there. You use two of them. It's more stable. Anyways, so you know, if you need some earplugs, this is about two and a half inches that I'm ripping through here, and. Plenty of depth there on that blade. So, here we go. And there you go. Rip right through. A little dust, not too bad. And we're going to go on to the next tool. All right, here we're moving on to the routers. I own the OF14, <clears throat> OF1400. They also make uh, the MFK700, which is great for uh, routing edges, you know, light, light router work. Um, <clears throat> there's also the OF1010, which I'm not, don't know too much about, a little less power than the 1400. And they also make the OF2200, which, is pretty powerful can basically route anything that you need um, I got the 1400 because it does basically most general routing that I need to be done and you know I have a, a table router um, that does most of my heavy you know raised panel stuff like that but anyways this is just a example What's great about the Festool is that <clears throat> it's got all these 
accessories that go with it. You could use it with the guide rail, hook it up to the vacuum, make a little less dust. And you know, I went through some MDF here, routed out part of some 2x4s, and I mean, it just breezes right through it. And I used the 32 inch guardrail, or they call it the FS. 800. Um, if you're doing some edge routing, you can still hook up your vacuum with the edge router accessory. And I mean, just the accessories never end with this company. I mean, they think of everything. And you got depth stops. You can set these up and set up your stops here, everything like that. To, you know basically wherever you want and you push it down turn the wheel and you're locked in then here you can just press the button press this in and you're locked in you don't have to hold the trigger anymore you just route it straight down but that's enough of that, and we're going to move on to the next one. I'm going to breeze through the Sanders here. Uh, I own the ETS-125 and the RO-90. The ETS-125 was my first Sander purchase, which really works out well with the vacuum hookup. I'm not going to demonstrate that. We've done enough of that, and this is video is getting way too long. Um, <clears throat> but you can see all the holes are all set up so that you have the suction going right through there. So there's good dust, dust extraction. This is the Festool one, and this is just a basic sander pad you can see there you can't really use the regular sander pads with it but I mean you could if you're outside something like that you don't need to uh, worry about dust in the shop or in the customer's house so anyways that's that the RO90 is really one of my favorites because you can use it as a high speed sander, a random orbit sander with this this pad. Or you can go on to a it comes with a delta pad also, which you can snap on and get into tight spaces. So and of course it comes in a nice sustainer. But that's enough about the sanders. They're great at keeping dust dust down and you know you want your shop clean they help out immensely so anyways we'll move on now you might be wondering how can the sortainers or the sustainers make my job easier well if you ever worked on a condo where you had to park a mile away from the actual place wheeling these babies down there with the vacuum that way you have your vacuum down there you have screws and whatever other tools you need whether you need the router the track saw or those are actually the sanders in there I got both sanders in there or you need your drill whatever you need you can just stack them all up on here and just keep on going. And great thing about this, I mean, you need a pocket hole jig. You got that in there. All the screws. You need wood screws. You got those in there too. And, you know, you get the big, the bigger one. I got finish nails and whatnot in here. I could take all these out. I could put my nail gun in here. Or whatever I needed you know there's plenty of room for whatever I need in there 
I'm going to wrap this up with the drill that I have. It's the T15 plus 3. Labels come in loose, but you can re reprint these labels yourself. We'll talk about that later. The Festival's Owner Group is a good, great place to go for any information, extra information that you need, or if you have any issues with your tools. Um, you got a little compartment on top. This nice uh, sustainer. You can have all different bits, drill bits, whatever you need in here. You can basically throw anything in there. Locks up, all ABS. Lift that up. You got your charger. There are some things back here. Drill would be sitting here. Different chuck. Lift this up, you got room for all the interchangeable chucks that you have. The depth set chuck, right angle, and the offset. And room for the extra battery, so you don't need to charge these too much. Underneath, you can basically store almost anything extra you need. There's some anchors, drill bits, whatever. I mean, it, plenty of room in here and that's the great thing about Festool. They think of almost everything. They have great storage capacity and basically think of everything. Sorry if you look at my face again, but with like two hands for this. With the T15, you know, they make the new one, the hybrid with the impact driver, but the Centrotech is such a great system, plus the inter interchangeable heads. I mean, you just snap it down like that, change your bit need to drill it's changed out no problem you have on board magnetic four different drill bits that you could have in there and we all know that we run into situations where we need a flat hat or you know need to change the bit out rather than wasting time with uh, going insertion you got them right there no problem and if you need to change the head say you're in a tight area you need to change the head over you got right angle bit head whatever go back to basic there you go plus the other heads that I spoke about before and these batteries just seem to last forever. I mean, I don't know how how much time I, I can get basically like a day out of one battery almost. And it's just incredible. Compared to other, other tools, these tools are the best manufactured that I've ever seen. And, you know, you don't have to go with a whole system at once. You try one out see how it goes I mean they have a great warranty and great information going through the festival owners group dot com you have no problems I mean I've been so happy with these tools they've lasted for years I started buying them like six years ago seven years ago and like I mentioned the vacuum was the only issue that I had. I they they shipped it out for me and returned it to me. It's been going three four years, no problems. I've been so happy with the company and they do a great job. So if for anything, that's why I keep buying Festool and that's why you should too. Thank you for watching my video.